Welcome back to another episode of the Dynamax Podcast. I am your host, Isaiah, and joining me is... Me. And me. I'm and... Floridian. Oh, God, God. The manager, uh, uh, security? <laughs> oh, my God. This is going to be Alex, like a... That's kind of racist of you, by the way. He's Floridian. That's like, that's like one fourth crocodile. At least I'm not Ohio. One fourth oh, crocodile. Hold on a second. What is that? What was that, Jeff? At least I'm not Ohio. Bitch, Ohio, Ohio is better than decide, Florida. I, I, oh, Ohio came to decide what state it wants to be. Girl. Hey, do you live in Ohio? Yes. Yeah. Um. Did you do that? Oh, on oh, you poor, oh, you oh, that's it. Hang on, I'm I'm go I'm coming up there. I'm coming up there. Wait, hang on, give me a minute. I mean, that's better than living in Florida with all the races. I don't know about all that. Ohio do got some, um, you know, some neos. The fuck does that even mean? I got the Ohio <laughs> Devil. Y'all got zombies. We also got white men. Is that zombies? really a? <laughs> I mean, Fresco, Fresco, Ohio is more indecisive than like uh, a, I think, uh, a 90s sitcom I, episode about prom. I didn't Hello? even get to introduce myself. <laughs> <laughs> and to go graduate in high school. Yeah, oh, yeah. I'm, fi- I'm finally entering the. I'm finally ad- uh, entering uh, the real world, I suppose. Also known as Ohio. Oh God, I don't want to go to Ohio. If y'all, if y'all don't, if y'all don't get this. <laughs> If y'all don't keep our hell out of your mouths, I don't know. The, the, like, two times, the, I don't know. Like the three times better I than to Florida. I never wanted to come back. Yeah, it's not really much of a competition. Dude. I don't care, I, I, Isaiah. <laughs> Alex, you were right about his voice sounding like he just speaks off a of helium. He's president yeah. of the helium factory. You stand, Diantha. Fuck off. Game Diantha. Guys, oh. guys, come on. It, I love how he says it every time. Like that's gonna insult me. I'm like, I never guys, said I. I mean, you bring up you. You insult me all the time, and it, bro. Come on, guys. We got two very important special episodes to talk. About. I don't give a damn Sun about the moon, episodes. I'm slandering Isaiah right now. <laughs> Chris, that's it. Chris, that's it. You're 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 you're, oh, you're on the podcast. You're, you're going down that corner. <laughs> okay, okay, but for real. Let's okay, let's go to the episodes. Shut up, so I can speak. For real, let's go on to the episodes. <laughs> We got Sun and Moon 151. Yeah. Oh my. 151. The finale mm. of the Sun and Moon anime. Reminder the Pokemon oh, Sun and oh, Moon don't anime say that. from 2016 to 2022. That's crazy. Yeah. I can't believe it That's lasted crazy. six whole years. I, I, that was a weird hiatus that went on. It was like, a, it was giving Hunter Hunter a run for its hiatus. I know, That's right? That's crazy. That's insane. And the episode for Sun and Moon 151 is a triumph return, the Lola champion. And my god. Oh. Sun and Moon episodes do not miss. My god, that was such a powerful episode. There's just so much to talk about. Yeah. Just it, was, it was all the setup that, that it did. It was so crazy. That title, that episode title alone would have genocided all the red stands if I didn't do it. I mean, I think they already died from the first yeah. time when he won the lead. Oh, oh yeah, they're, they're, already, they're gone. It was already over, by They're the gone. I, I oh, love man. how many people show up in this episode. I wasn't expecting uh, Malu's uh, dad and brother to show up. I wasn't Me expecting neither. James to show up. It was crazy. Yeah, that was good. Uh, Lola little episodes are just... Oh, we, even, we even got to see Team Skull. Yeah. Like, all yeah. of them. Uh, we saw Howard. We saw Hal for a split second. Everything was great. Yeah, salty, salty um, how in the corner. <laughs> it's like yeah, Zach, he was upset. Like, oh, it was an insta banger. It's, it's funny that he was he was there at, like the fight, not the like the party. Cause he's salty. Yeah. <laughs> salty, he salty how? I wish we um, <laughs> I wish we could have seen uh, what was it? Um, I really feel like the like. Lana in the Kaharu episode in this moment really felt like a um a whole other episode just kind of crammed in this one. I would have loved to see 
just like that. No, you just wouldn't have. Shut your lying ass up. No, it would be a whole episode of Lana, and then like, and then some, and then some blank character that just talks every now and then. You mean it's literally complained that Lana was? If Kaharu could have a whole episode with stupid dog biscuits, she could have an episode with Miss Bubbles. Are you talking about? Are you talking about yep. the three the three minutes of Lana telling Koharu to screw off and just let Evie be Evie? Yeah, she just. She I kind of want. I love you, Lana, but that made me kind of want to punt Lana into the sun. I'm like, this is <laughs> not a whole journey just to make her go like, you know, Evie. It's not. It's not. Know. It's not Lana's fault that Koharu is a fucking dunce and hasn't been looking oh, at Ash and Pikachu trash. this whole time. <laughs> Shut up. Lana's That's like. Not, Lana's like. It's like Ash and Pikachu. You know those two people right there. And then Koharu went. Ah! Oh. All this Kaharu oh. slander all this Kaharu slander would make Zach teleport to this episode right now. Zach he just like hops in the call and is like, yeah, he's going faster Kaharu. than Jeff. And I'm like, we're not out here slandering, we're just talking and then Jeff and Zach and Alex this bump like Kaharu slander and then, and then me and Rai just sigh, you're like, uh oh, here comes the dislikes and we just get disliked by him like so much. Because you're a boss Twitter. Busted. Oh, Cringe no. boss Twitter. <laughs> oh god, that's gonna make things worse. <laughs> it just makes me wonder, though. It just makes me wonder, though, now if now is this, um. We're gonna have any more Kaharu moments, or is that just it? Like, it's, no, it's okay. I'll have like, one big episode at the very, very end. Uh, I think it would be funny yeah. if that was it. So I'll say, That'd yeah. be hilarious. I don't know. It just felt like. She's like, oh, staying in Eevee is an option. And it's like, well, you, you doing that? Yeah, but she doesn't um, have her. If I look in Afterthought compared to everything else here. Yeah. I love that when they told Kiawe, it's like, Oh yeah, Lily's coming! Oh, and apparently Ash is coming back. He's like, What?! <laughs> He's like, I gotta go trade. And it's like, Aw, oh, crazy. I love how Sophocles is the one to bring up, like, We watched every one of your battles, and he's like, Yeah, me and my brother watched the Raihan one, like, on our TV. Glad, the internet. Glad and then Gladion just starts choking on his orange juice. <laughs> why is, why is Sophocles such a good hype man? He's, he's like, Dude, you're in the world championships fighting, you're, you're working your way up to Don. And it's like, Damn, Sophocles. I he's like, You're beating the, the undefeated one. champion Don Day. He's like, Yeah, I've been watching. You're the Lola League champion after all, and Astar is blushing. He's like, Yeah, thanks. He's just so humble here. I want to give Ash a little hug and then, like, a couple Sophocles is like that type of friend who'd walk up to you and say, Hey, your battle was the bee's knees. <laughs> oh. No! I don't the think bee's knees. I don't think he'd say that. The bee drills. I think he would. Think no, he no, that's not the Clemon said. That's not the Clemon said. Well, but Ash, your battle was the bee's knees. Sophocles, come up, Sophocles, Sophocles comes up to Ash and he goes, and he goes, Okay, so I'm gonna rank every one of your hyper class battles right now. The Volkner one was a nine out of ten. The B one was a ten out of ten. What the <laughs> fuck was that Marnie battle? That one was like a six out of ten. The Dress <laughs> one was a four out of ten. If I'm being honest. And Lily's like, it's highly yeah. illogical that Marnie should appear for more than a minute. It's, it's highly like, illogical that Gengar could be the dark, a dark, a dark fairy type. And mm -hmm. And Lana's like, Marnie's mid, and then she just get a bunch of dislikes on her Twitter. Nah. Uh, I mean, she wouldn't, she would be, she would be right, though. Uh, we, we saw the uh, Lola Pokemon, it's always great. I'm wow, I'm surprised Koharu Don't, don't worry, if Girl Boss Twitter comes after us, I'm the real girl boss. You're not the alpha like, girl boss, I'm sorry like, to tell you that in the go, I gotta be honest. <laughs> I'm the, actually I'm kind of like the, the uh, an, I'm like the anti like antithesis to all the girl bosses out there. We're like the, that sounds pretty based to me. We're like the we're negative. Like, sounds like you have a job. Oh yeah, can we talk about just Ash and Lay and their interactions? He's like, you're like, uh, oh, oh yeah. yeah. And then, oh, and, and, then and then when Ash and Kakuya were, and then when Ash and Kakuya were the little masks and going in, and you know, he's like, eh. <laughs> he's starting to do it too. He, he's literally copying that. That whole family Lay moment was just wholesome. So good. I'm not trusting anyone who calls Lay ugly. You know who you people oh, are. I know who they are. If Lay's an ugly baby to you, then you were the ugliest baby. I definitely know who they are. Because <laughs> everyone always like, Lay's so ugly. I'm like... How? I, don't know, I saw May as a baby. She it was looks like ugly. a lot of people that say that. <laughs> like, 
What the? It's made after like some of the hottest Pokemon characters ever. You're saying that things, you're saying that thing is gonna be like turning out to be, look like a goblin. It's like a goblin. Mm. <laughs> a goblin. Oh, oh like, you're right, Isaiah. No, you're right. No, no. Lay, Lay has Lay has Kakui and Burnett's genes. Oh, oh man. Yeah. It's, it's got it's got a it's got a good future ahead of him. I really wish he'd be the next protagonist, but my heart. That's what I'm oh. hoping for. Cause Sorry. you know I'm not. Give I'm up. not trying to see. <laughs> I'm not trying to see. Ash. 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 I don't want to see him get destroyed True. by a level 5 quack. Come on, please. come on, come on. What, what, you think you're telling me Pikachu's going to lose to a Lechonk? That's going to be, like, cringe. Yeah, he's going to get Lechonked, like, in the head. <laughs> he's got, Lechonked. That's it. Lechonked <laughs> in the head, yeah. That's it, I'm putting up my... He said Lechonked. Lechonked in the head, yep. That, that's what the Battle Royale was. I, I never right. thought Wiki and I never thought Wiki and Fava would be really good announcers until this episode. They were they were really good because yeah. just the scene of them going, "Come on, say it now, give us a good warming Alula," and then it's like, "Come on, do it louder," and I'm like, "Oh, oh this is getting me hyped." The crowd just more and more going, "Oh, Lola. It's, oh it's so great." Episodes that make me miss Sun and Moon. <laughs> what do you mean? That's what this was. The, the moment where, it's, <laughs> yeah, the moment where it's like the moment where it's like Ed Gladion and his Ultra Beast Lily, and then everyone's like Lily, and then it's like Lana. Who, who was it? Was it then Lana? The, then Lily's like, yeah, she's yeah. my sister. No, she's like it's a new member of the family, and then Lana's like Ultra Beast Lily, and it's like yeah. That that is what it is. <laughs> Yeah. Wait. Uh, uh, the, the battle's so much fun. Yeah. They were all gutting for Ash, which caught they me. They all started out just going And that for makes us. a lot of sense. It does it's like, make a lot of sense. Just you wouldn't expect here. that to actually happen. It's yeah. also fun seeing the anime keep being funner than the games because battle royales aren't that fun in the games. Oh, I, I, Absolutely. they I hate mess them. them up. <laughs> I hate them. I hate them in the games. By the way, is Isaiah able to talk? Is he? Uh, uh, no, it's no, it's can't not. Hear him if he to talk. Mm. Oh, 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 oh! I heard something. I think it's cool we gotta see another move tutor move from the crown tundra meteor beam i don't know i just like seeing those moves is that so. not i thought that was just a signature <laughs> no 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 <laughs> surprisingly none of the ultra beasts have signature moves huh like you know they they all have a signature isn't, ability they're all isn't ultra the, beasts. isn't Blessed one the only one with one oh wait you're right mind blown i forgot about that yeah bless the one is the only one that does signature moves. fake fan I'm a big fan. I just forgot about that. I don't know. Just cool seeing the moves. I wonder if any more are gonna show up, like Scorching Sands or like. I uh, there's definitely time. Probably. Ah. I love I'm seeing Rising to the Rising Voltage Conqueror. Yeah, that was. Neat. I did think see, it's. See. Oh. Oh, Isaiah's back. Uh, uh, there we uh, go. No. No, nope, wait. As I do you start pressing that that seems to fix things. I don't nope. think it worked. Alright, Isaiah Isaiah's being attacked by the stars. It's the XY ninjas. <laughs> yeah, they they XY ninjas? The XY ninjas if they're X if they're XY ninjas, then they're not ninjas. They're, they're mm -hmm. XY ninjas. What did they be frog? Yeah, <laughs> they're, they're they're frogs and they're like frogs and shinobi mice. Shinobi mice. Yeah. <laughs> they're like they're like they're like shooting through Isaiah's internet cables. It's like he can't talk about yeah. Oh no. It's cool seeing Kiawe be like be Gladion. <laughs> That was really cool. Uh, yeah. yeah that like was... during the fight, he's like, "Wait a minute, we're all going after Ash." 
He's like, Gladion! And it's like, Gladion's like, oh shit. Yali just pauses for a moment. He's like, hey, I remember when you cuffed my Z move with your disc dog. <laughs> He's like, I'll show you a real iron head on for size. <laughs> then it's just like knocked out and they'll leave going like damn Kiawe, damn Marowak. <laughs> damn Kiawe. If it wasn't damn. for the fact that if it wasn't for the fact that Zay always had a little bit Marowak on his team, I'd be like, I would call dibs on him. But it's like yeah, Zay is <laughs> Sir, there's a frog outside. <laughs> Can't just post memes. Can't it looks run. like it looks like they're all waddling out. They are waddling that is out. You gotta be careful about the frog. They might they might step on it. Yeah, there's a frog in the grass outside. Oh good, maybe he can fuse with me. Yo. <laughs> sir. I say, oh, uh, hello. I was trying to say one of my favorite things is before the battle where Ash is begging we to put on the royal mask persona. He's like, No, you're the star of this, you're the Lola champion. Yeah, it's little that stuff like, like that that just made Kukui and Ash's bomb like one of the greatest things the anime has ever produced. That was, such a, that was such a good like symbolism thing. It's like, oh, you can't wear the mask. That's like hiding who you really are. You're a Lola champion. You're not Mask Rail yeah. Jr. And it's like, aw. I don't know. <laughs> right. it's, just cool seeing, it's just cool seeing Pokemon get like, you know, metaphorical and shit. Yeah, that's what that. That's what this episode and like the last Alola episode did really well with like Lily and like the family. It's just like just symbolism for shit. Something I also really do like is how you're able to just see like even though Ash is the strongest trainer there and even though he's able to attack him, whenever Ash attacks somebody or is able to get a hit, it doesn't really hurt them all that much. It shows like they're not all super far behind Ash and I love stuff like that. Because the only Maybe thing Bath was really sense. doing was outspeeding them with a um, quick attack and dodging. Oh, dude, Pikachu if anything, is boss. If yeah. anything, it really shows you that Ash couldn't beat everyone here single-handedly. It took Kiawe taking down, like, Lily. It took, like, uh, Kakui Darkest Larrying, like, Marowak. Yeah, Lolo's full of hitters, man. Like, I don't think I, I don't think Ash could have, like, realistically, like, knocked them all out. <laughs> I think Pikachu I still don't even I... think he would be able to win if if um Gladion used a valley. Because that's the oh, thing. He, used to he, would, he would have to have like Incineroar. Oh, he would, yeah, he would have to be like neat. He'd be like, Pikachu, get behind Incineroar. Kakui, take down the dog. <laughs> and he's like The captain's now memory. Okay, don't Ash, worry, don't worry, I got this. <laughs> Incineroar, blast the bird! Seven, not, take the fire memory. Not the, not the SoundCloud dog. But yeah. <laughs> Sound that thing cloud. isn't even a dog. Know. It's an abomination. It's like Dracovish. It, it kind of. Like, I mean, you're not wrong. But one day like, we'll ask Chicken B. Does. does. One day we'll, does. one day we'll get to see all the Pokemon that Valley's made out of. Um, that I oh, um. <laughs> When Sibeli was revealed, there was like videos of people being like, now, this could be like Scyther. And this this is a like Combuskin. Combuskin? Yeah, they'd be like, Scyther. yeah, they'd be like, this top part comes from like, I don't know, Groudon or whatever. Hello. That would be. That would be insane. A Chimera. Or oh my playing. gosh, you know this battle doesn't have good animation. It has such good pacing, like where. Gladion uses meter beam, meteor beam and it knocks away both Pikachu and Incineroar. It really yeah. does feel like everyone's just pretty much near equal footing, even if they're obviously not all on it. There's so many cool shots of just their eyes and their Pokemon using attacks. Yeah. Because one thing people were saying is Ash is going to easily overpower everybody in Alola, but that really yeah. wasn't the case. I'm really happy Boy. about that. Uh, seeing the, I like how so far, um, Kiawe, if you, if we ever see him use the flying, flying, uh, Z crest with Charizard, he'll be the only person in Sun and Moon to use all his Z moves. And Sun and Journeys. I do find it funny, though, when it was just Pikachu and Incineroar, they felt extremely, extremely equal, like, whenever I was looking at it. It's just like, man, I really do believe if Kukui wanted to be in the Masters, they eat good. He's a, he's, he's, yeah, he's a professor. He's a I think he's a teacher and, and, and a loving and a loving father. He ain't got. Just remember, he had to use the ten million thunderbolt against it. 
Mm-hmm. And then they kept it ambiguous. Like, even if we know Ash wins, he still had to use it mm-hmm. to win. Something cool, I think, I think is... Crazy I, 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 I think... Yeah. No, go ahead. And again, he also had to use it on Volkner. Well, Volkner's scary. Volkner was like, Volkner was People... like, hey, hey, I hear yeah. you got the strongest electric type move. I need you to hit me with it. I'm an electric type specialist. And Ash is like, <laughs> you sure about that? You, you sure about, about this? Yeah, hit me, hit me. And then Ash is like, winds up, okay, man. And then it cuts to Volkner in the hospital. <laughs> <laughs> it's the, okay, maybe that's a meme. Okay, <laughs> think... he, he sees the... <laughs> the meme. No, go in the girl. The part that got to me was, uh, doesn't this take you back, Satoshi? Oh, yeah. Yeah, and then it cuts to just a flashback of Sun and Moon. They did, like, I, lo- I still love how they just straight up u- just use Sun and Moon footage, because, like, you can't just replicate something like that. There's no way. Well, I knew that would not if they tried to own that door. <laughs> when they... When they started ch- a chanting champion to him, I, I felt oh, like yeah. that boy. Yeah, that almost made me cry. I like that that started like in the flashback. It, it starts in the flashback that where they show the crowd, cool. and then it cuts to this, and it's like ah. Yeah, that's just, such a callback. Oh my god! They even say Ash is repre- they even say Ash is representing a wall too, which is amazing. Yeah, and it's I true. Think, I think something I cool right. about this episode, it like Brian I feel like right. this episode introduces like the entire Alola region to like. The Pokemon World Championships because, like, I don't think we saw any Alola contenders besides Ash in the World Championships. And I don't know, them, just them being like, hey, you're representing us in this thing. And it's like, huh. This I is why it just, just needs to be said in the actual thing. <laughs> this, this is why Ash needs to win and then retire. Because it's like, it's like the, the first Alola League yeah. where it's like, everyone's free to enter because, you know, so people might not want to do it. And it's like, everyone after seeing this, it's like, ooh. Out. One else will join next year. I definitely think it's set up for Ki- Kiawe and Lydion to join the next one. With who they're going to see the next one. Well, <laughs> Ryan, <laughs> shut up! <laughs> Don't know uh, this is I do like that really for... end though at the end with Tapu Koko giving it the blessing, so he'll win the tournament. That was it has to happen though. Right? It has to happen. Is that it? Son of a does shit like this. It's, oh, you you got to win for us. You're the Alola champion. Taco Coco Pri- It's like, it, it, it's it's Sun and Moon. I, I trust it more than, like, I trust real people at this point. See, it does yeah. that, and then you've got, and then you've got freaking Leon over there. Please beat me, please beat me, please beat me, please beat me. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah that's, that's, like, that's, like, that's <laughs> why I have some of that confidence is that, like, someone maybe, mentioned it, that in maybe. Sword and Shield, it is a part of his character growth and that and him losing, and even in Journeys, like, he mentioned that like him not losing actually kind of scared him a little. And it wasn't and, then, like and, and, Twilight, and in Twilight Wings, he was literally depressed. Leon was yeah, it's almost like you actually read and play the game to actually understand a character. It, it's on mm-hmm. par for it's on par for a Kanto person becoming the Alola's like region's first champion. What? It's just like. That, that crucial storytelling that they kind of always make canon. And then even like in the third opening from Sun and Moon where we see Incineroar versus <laughs> Pikachu, it's like, oh, we never got that. And now it's like, oh, we did get it. It happened. It's now, like, I trust like, this now, series more than my, I trust how about this series we, more uh, than my parents. <laughs> how about we show uh, Ash's Incineroar battle? Hmm? Hmm? Next uh, series. <laughs> no. I wish that would happen, but I re- Ash, we could talk about that when we get to the Paul one. You do have another yeah. episode. Yeah. Ooh, Project cool. Mew is finally the last reading Project its Mew. comics. And that makes me so people thought this episode of Project Mew was the last one. Why was it? It the was title. the last the one, knowledge. regular one, trial one. Now on their chasers. Yup. And I know me and Jeff are probably going to have a lot to say about Gary Youngo being on a similar level because I've seen a lot of people complain about that. Yeah. Like, I don't want to say that Gary has always been on the weaker side. Like, he's not weak, but he's always been on the weaker side in terms of rivals. Like, back in Diamond and Pearl, he couldn't even be one of the Team Galactic admins. So, yep. Y'all got to remember, Gary is only. 
Like, it's a miracle that he still trains the amount he does, because Gary has, like, made it clear in Diamond and Pearl. Research is pretty much my lifeblood now. That dude's Gary, retired. The last yeah. time Gary... The last time Gary was a, a, you know, a battling trainer was Johto. That's, like, 20 That's... years ago. Yeah. No, like, Ash, Ash beat him with his, like, Johto Kanto hybrid team. It's like... That's... Man, that's sad. He got beat by, uh, Muck. He's still he got cut by Charizard. I'm kidding, Muck. But yeah, you know, it's not like... It's not like Go hasn't been, you know... Hanging around the champion of Alola for 113 episodes or anything oh, like that. Of course not. Right, no, it's no, not no, like no, it's no, not no, like no. not like Go didn't already face you know genocide of a space I, alien dragon or think... or kangaroo <laughs> Jesus after that. Um, you know, kangaroo you know. Jesus. Yeah, yeah, that's that's what I call hey, him. That's me too. That's, me that's too. literally what he is. Oh, <laughs> I, always, I always think the part that it always be it's like. Oh, go go stronger than it's like they didn't battle. They, he didn't beat him. They were working together. Oh, but he could he could work with him, and it's like, what are you talking about? What? You came in you came in rationalizing in your own mind to be like, well, Gary just up go. It's like no, no, go's bringing him down. And it's like what? I, I don't know. He can't be helped. I think it is pretty obvious though that they are setting them up being very close to equals though. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So I can confidently say that Go is probably going to surpass Gary, but... I mean, when you're catching legendaries like that, you know... I like that. I like that Go brought Plus, possibly the best. Gary, Gary fans should be happy. He has a Reggie Drago. That's pretty oh. cool. <laughs> Are they going to keep him? Are they going to keep him? Uh, I uh, they better. So. That'd be cool. They better. Because if you think about it... If um if there's five chasers and five Reggies, it's like uh, okay Tokyo, you get to pick a Reggie. Same with same with like the red and blue girl. Dying girl. <laughs> red and blue girl, still waiting on their backstories. <laughs> um, so Rogi has the most overpowered team. He has he has four really, legendaries on his team. He really does, man. Can we talk about the, the, the? Can we just talk about the very, very beginning where in fight tell? <laughs> <laughs> it just starts repeating the shit out Reggie Steel. That that tag move was pretty cool though. That's oh, pretty lucky. Get better than Master Z. Yeah, it would be over. <laughs> <laughs> the weird part about this episode is he's like, you can only use two Pokemon. It's like, you're fighting Reggie, Elegi, Reggie, what? <laughs> only one. Well, I mean, it's supposed to be well, difficult. Why do you beat it in AG? People start foaming at the mouth. <laughs> I, do like that, um, I do like that, what's it called? Um, Go brought possibly his best Pokemon for this, being a brown dragon type to fight an electric dragon type. Yeah. Combination? Not combination. I don't know. I just like seeing stuff like that. Same with the the two chasers. They brought two ice types and two ground types, and it's like, oh, two ice types for the Reggie Draco and two ground types for the electric electric one. Clever. My God, Dylan and Gary's whole relationship and chemistry throughout this episode was amazing. I really do like the way they just bounce off each other. Yeah, the way they were just trying to. Come really good. Each other. They definitely. They definitely oh, have oh. each other, like, they definitely have each other muted on, like, social grams. Uh, I don't know about that after this. I don't know, they were gonna fizz <laughs> bump, they were gonna, they were gonna fizz bump, they were gonna fizz bump, but then they didn't. And it's Why like, is oh, there, man. where is this a section of Twitter that hates that Go and Gary are rivals? I don't Which, get that. That's I so really weird. Don't they didn't this. even pay but attention to the Go that's... insults them or something, and no. I'm like, that's not Serena. Ah, it's right. It's worse. Oh, this biracial kid. Why is he half black? Oh. <laughs> it's uh, but I'm yeah, it's not if, like if Go. It's like, I'm just gonna say, if you're a big Gary fan, you should be happy he's Go's rival. If it wasn't for Go, he'd he'd be one and done. He would he would show up, go, hey Ash, and then never never see him again. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. If you're if you're over here being like I'm the number one Gary stand, it's like, well, you either have to thank Go or you have to become Gary the Snail stand over here. 
If it wasn't for Go, he he would have had like two episodes of Journeys at most, I'd say. He'd just be like with Professor Oak being like, hey Ash, your Infernape went to fight Moltres for whatever reason. Smell you later. <laughs> Smell you later. <laughs> I think they gave Gary a reason why he's in Project Mew, though. I remember a lot of people are complaining about it. Like, it was never explained, but, but it, this episode what? explained it. Pokemon. Uh, me, I thought it was returning. You would explain that. They, they don't read. <laughs> the people kind of wanted a more like, why is Go doing this? Why is he not? I think it'd be up? cool. It's one of those things cool like... Of stuff, like, stated to them multiple times so it gets into their brain. I think it'd be cool if they went even deeper with it. Like, something about, like, Professor Oak being like, I never discovered Mew, and then Gary's like, "Well, I may have one up you, old man. I'm gonna find him." I do love I the tag team of Cinderace and Blastoise. I'm just using their like eight mm -hmm. starter that, Pokemon. That, so that, that is so move. perfect. That is that's, so perfect. That's a cool. That's a cool duo for real. It really is. Mm -hmm. I gotta I say, like just seeing... the way Go has been using, like, Inteleon and Cinderace and his other Pokemon for Project Mew has been fantastic. It really makes it feel like Go has, a, like, a main team and then a secondary team that he uses, and I really like that. I wish we could have just seen more Project Mew episodes. That would have been great. Yeah, yeah if only it started I earlier. Like, like I, I love agree. seeing, like, I love in this episode, we basically get to see, fuck, fuck hang on, Reggie. We can see like seven like Galar Pokemon in this episode, but I'm also like that that one shot of Dramanitan is gonna be like the only thing we see. Of man. <laughs> that, that, that <laughs> yeah, it's just sliding. <laughs> it's just and then like go with like a hat ring. It's like oh now Bay's definitely not showing up, and it's like ah. Oh. oh yeah, well, um, I don't know. People didn't think Hop was gonna show up. I think it's possible Beat could show up, but he's not kind he of gonna a do that thing in the games where I don't want him to show up at this point because there's because there's. There's, There's no gonna do point. something bad for There's no point. Mm, I wouldn't Gary, say all that. I Gary mean, they're dumbing down up to a cheerleader. I mean, it's better than him not appearing. I'll take that. Nah, 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 nah. You don't want him to show up at Fresk all? Moment. Fresk moment. Fresk when a Galar character appears. No, 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 no. I mean... Oh, uh, where's Nessa? Where's that? And he's still trash. <laughs> Well, not in trash, but he's still mid. See, if this game will finish it, he's still... Tw I'm talking about the anime. Ooh. Oh, Bead? Marty? Uh, no, I'm talking about... I'm talking about Hob. Oh. Uh, Damn. Hmm. I mean, he's not going to be as good in the games, but let's just see how they handle him. He's going to be, I mean, gonna, he's gonna be like... Now. Hop's gonna be like, you inspired me Thanks. to go to the Spain region, Ash. And Ash will go to Spain region. That would be pretty cool, actually. You say that, Jeff, but they're gonna be crying when Ash shows up with like a little <laughs> Spanish hat. He's like, he's like, oh Hola. no, let's go. Oh, like, he's just oh, crying. But Boston, oh no, let's I'm, go with oh, Dora. No, I'm taking everybody. Animals. Oh, no, Ash, oh, no, Ash, Ash is gonna be like, Ash is gonna be, Ash is gonna be boots to Dora. And if if Ash doesn't get his ass out of Spain. Bruh, la boca, idiota, Jeff Jeff broke out his Spanish dictionary. Oh sorry, the Dominican half came out. He learned that from he learned that from Terry the crocodile. That, that crocodile has been to Mexico. Yeah. Okay, I got we got two more things we can talk about with Annie Popey. The Paul episode oh, wow. and the interview we got for the anime regarding the Masters 8. You guys better be ready next week. You, you you stand by for episode reviews. Stand by. Stand by for that episode review. Stand by. Oh boy. Let me just say that this episode, if you're a Gengar fan, you're really gonna like this episode. Man, mm. Gengar, man, Gengar, man, I can't believe that's not a Gengar. I love Jeff. Really? Like, <laughs> Gengar, yeah, just, Jeff, 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 like, I heard as soon as I mentioned Gengar, that disgust. Um, 
Gengar, Ooh. Gengar's been, Gengar's been, he, he tied with uh, Raihan's Gudra, beat like, hey, he's, he's getting, he's get he's getting there, he's escaping the alligator. His move set's more, his, his move set's more complicated, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. His, his move set's more like complicated than like every XY Pokemon put together. Well, there, well, he doesn't use cut, that's for sure. Yeah. <laughs> um... I feel like we could talk oh about Oh my gosh, the boy Paul is coming back. And Masahi is solo Masaki anime. Wane, he's been over here animating this episode. He's like, he's like making every frame perfect. He's like, I know, I know. You know, have you seen how much Paul are? He's, he's, so, he's, he's, yeah, he's, 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 <laughs> he's like, I've been drawing Paul every day for the last 12 years. It's like, it's like, uh, it's like that week. When uh, during Pokemon Evolutions, when the Zidia episode happened, he just kept posting nonstop Zidia art. Now it's Paul. I don't know how he, he does it. I don't been, know how he does it. He's been waiting for this. I like that. Um, I like that. Now apparently, Paul has had a Pokemon of every type, even if you count the Azumarill. Oh, does he actually? Yeah, he does. Yeah. If you retroactively count the Azumarill, like nope, very doesn't type count. Right now, He's missing one. <laughs> right. Okay, well he probably he probably if he has like most of the champions Pokemon, he I mean it wasn't even that it wasn't even that toy back then, so why does Ryan? He probably, why he probably Ryan... has a guard I mean they were wreck on it either way. Yeah. Why does Ryan sound like Brandon right now? <laughs> no no, no. Reggie no. Frog, you stole it! No, it doesn't count. No. They were wreck on it. The cool thing about this episode, though, we got, like, um, some information, like, how the episode originally was going to go down. It was going to be, like, Ash visiting his Pokemon, and they're going to be cheering him on. But they were like, okay, why don't we include Paul in this and give him a nice big role? So I'm like, I really do like how they're including Paul in it. Didn't they also reveal how the series in general was originally going to be? Yeah, oh, but that's going to be safe for a little bit later, but it's like... Probably. Past meets future. How do you guys feel about like the possibilities of Ash might not use his reserves for the Master Z? Good. I do not care. <laughs> I've heard enough about reserves, and I've in my final verdict is I do I'm, not care. I'm dead. <laughs> oh, can I go? I feel yeah, like no. if they were gonna do reserves, I feel like if they were gonna do reserves, they should have done it day one because it's like, mm -hmm. oh, yep. we're. Yep. I'm going to start using reserves, because, like, it feels just like a weird thing to just be like, I'm suddenly going to use reserves, because it's like, it's like, that works for, like, a Pokemon game, but that that doesn't have, like, like an anime storyline. And my, if it was me, I probably would have had Ash start using reserves in the mask. No, 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 the hyper class. Yeah, oh, that's what I was hyper. thinking. That's when I, because I feel like when Ash first entered the hyper class, he should have had like this moment where he noticed that even just random jabronis were just crazy strong like now, Walter. and he, yeah, yeah. And then he just went to the uh, to Oak's lab, and he's like, "Hey, uh, these dudes on the street are kind of crazy. Can you give me septile, please?" That's just like <laughs> he can have just like I'm not gonna spoil it, but oh my gosh, Jeff, you're gonna have a reaction next week. <laughs> yeah, he's not yeah, yeah, he's not showing up. I will, <laughs> I will smite you and then devour the essence of your life force. And then I'll give you, I'll give you a little kiss back, Jeff. Don't worry. It'd be like that. But um, if like Astros had like Pikachu, like Riolu Farfetch, and then just like swapped out like three team members, like a lot. Yeah. Or something like that. Gengar just starts crying. Because I, like, I, the I feel like there's a couple Pokemon I'm looking at, like Cough, Oshawott, Cough. Um, Scraggy, Cough, Noivern, who could have gone? No, nah, not Noivern. Uh, yeah. no. <laughs> Noivern, get him out of here, one. dude. Take that one back. Never have. We'll go with Torterra. We'll go with, yeah. we'll go with Torterra. Yeah. yeah, let's go with Torterra. Let's like, go you know, we life. get like, we get like, I don't know. Oshawott evolving, Scraggy evolving. Torterra I would have definitely made Oshawott become a duot in this show. Yeah, that would have maybe been give us cool. maybe 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 somehow give us high ceiling samurai or whatever. I don't know. Ooh. No, no, I don't. I don't want all that. I don't. I don't think they. All right, do then we're getting high ceiling decidui and high ceiling typhlosion. No. No. You can do that with that. No. You can do that with that. No one cares about him. Fred, you best, like, you just made me happy, Alex. You just said Samurai. I think, think Kukui's just gonna make... just gonna time travel Ash again? Yes. 
It's time nah, to open, like... time travel will happen next gen. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, right, 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 yeah. true. Oh, I'm sensing some like So, yeah, dark just be ready for next week's episode because we're, we're gonna be we're gonna be all happy. Hopefully. Uh, like we very, always are. Like we always happy. are with journeys, apparently. It's gonna be very It's gonna, well, be, it's gonna be funny tonight. for the people who are like, I'm the one guy who's listened to every episode for the past like two weeks, and man, you guys were not excited about journeys, but now you are. I mean, these, not, these past eight episodes have been bangers. When was the last time it was even disappointing, the pool episode? I don't yeah. know. Some, some fella that was like, I probably what? don't and remember. And that was like, what? I don't know. The oh, blue wait. episode was... Let me see. I, I can think of a certain Halloween episode. Blue episode? What? No, what? not blue, the Pokemon character. Blue, the color. Oh. What you but you weren't expecting the disappointment, so was it really disappointing? Oh, it was eighty one. It was eighty one. Yeah, that was like, and that was forever ago in quarantine time. Oh. Eighty one was in September seventeenth last year. Oh, let me let me make sure because there are definitely That's almost a year. Fillers, definitely some fillers I don't remember whatsoever. Yeah, but I don't think there has been a bad one. Like or a boring one since then, at least for me. Yeah. At least they'll be at least they'll be introducing like either a Galar Pokemon or just something interesting. Because we got the Gengar stuff, the Lucario with the B stuff. Then we got um uh, Project what else New Hyperclass. We got Stopically's no, well, coming back. Well, I mean, oh, we've no. had Kaharu episodes. Oh yeah, that Kaharu episode. That was the circus. Wait, wait. <laughs> We've had Kaharu. Oh, that's not that's not on Jeremy's as fault. That's just because it's Kaharu. It's a Kaharu episode. <laughs> so. mm. Apparently, Kaharu was going to be a more blunt character. I was like, you took that away from me. You took the only thing I liked about her. I now yeah. I'm I, gonna I stop felt her. like I felt like that would have been hilarious. Definitely a lot more black early on. Yeah. Yep. Especially and then they just in went, the uh, and then they the just went. You're a nice girl now, and she went. I'm nice girl now. Yeah. Yeah, the the brainwash took control. <laughs> I do find it interesting that for the Masters Eight, they were just gonna do steel frames, and uh, that would have pissed me off. Oh uh, yeah, <laughs> if they uh, just do steels. They spared themselves from my meme folder. <laughs> Thank God, all the Lola League crowd on every battle. I'm so happy about that. Thank God. How many episodes were the Lola League again? Seventeen. Yeah. Hey, master, one. How, how many episodes do you think the Master Eight's gonna be? Twelve. Like, twelve. Probably like. I wanna say that. twelve. I know. It's, yeah, twelve yeah. is my guess. Twelve. It depends. Well, is, this, is, this, is, is it counting this one coming up? <laughs> or... Yeah. yeah. I always. Yeah. I would say I at the least. Maybe like third. At the least. At the least, around eight. No, no, I don't please. think. I don't think it it needs, it needs no. to be I said, at least. I said at no. the least. I said no. No. Yeah, because that's that's some Kalos League number. Please no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's why. That's why I said least. It's the Kalos League. Actually, the Kalos League was seven episodes, and it was still oh, most. It's gonna be oh, one hundred episodes. Imagine. <laughs> Turns into like Hunter Hunter the Khmer Antarch. It's like Dragon I use Drake over here. What's what's shit now? A bunch of Drake over here. Come back for next week to see the next attack. Chimera the Drake over here is still coming down. Yeah, Chimera Antarch anime is ridiculous. I feel like they could show two battles for everybody in the top eight. I feel like the first one. Yeah. The you know, Alola League, you had to do the exhibit battle and then like the first round. And they're pretty much starting off at the second round with the Masters 8. Because it's not 16, it's just 8. But that means instead of just being like 2v2s and 1v1s, they get to be like, I don't know, 2v2s and 3v3s. Oh yeah, and Hoppa's showing up. People are really upset they're not 6v6s. And he's and gonna, gonna hop Even Master though they weren't guaranteed. Why do why do people care so much about six v sixes? More Pokemon means more better. Cause brainwash. And then they're gonna be complaining when they're like crammed in a one episode with low tier animation. Six v sixes. What's that, Tyson? Oh. 
That boy gets one shot. I'm just like, I don't know. In VGC battles, they're like four Pokemon in like most competitive battles. Sometimes they're 3v3s. I mean, just saying, right? I mean, y'all want. Y'all want all 6v6s until there's two double KOs and a weird WWE reference in the beginning for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right, and, only, and literally, like, only the only reason that battle even gets brought up is because of the final showdown in it. Literally, literally. If, if, if I can find the one person who's like, Ash versus Shota was amazing, like, so amazing. Did you see Slurpuff versus Gudra? People Our... people started bringing up Noivern versus Salamence, even though that was mid as hell. See, they only brought that up because um, Ash versus Drazna looked like a PowerPoint presentation. <laughs> nah, <laughs> nah, nah Jeff, you know exactly sense. what I'm talking about when I refer to that, though. I do. Yeah. I do, but Jeff was still spitting with that, though. But da 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 but da da whoa, 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 but da 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 I love that video. I'm like, you know, animation wise, it it it, it did suck more than like my vacuum cleaner, but like story wise, kind of infinitely better. I find it funny but though, because no, like, I genuinely never. Doyford and Shota Salamence have a deep rivalry. They have an <laughs> unshakable bond of what? brotherly relationships. <laughs> the funny thing about the Jasna battles, I like, I literally like never even knew people had so many issues with in, within so like weeks later. That's true. That's true. I mean, I liked it. I was just never really blown away, like, compared to, like, Vogue B. I liked it. It's just I couldn't help but giggle whenever I saw, like, document word swings. Lucario <laughs> <laughs> one shot on Terraria. You mean the Ataria that was clearly weakened by Dracovish? Uh, like that. Like the scene where, like, the scene where Dracovish and Noivin were going to collide. <laughs> the kiss. The kiss. Yeah, they yeah. Justin kiss. They looked like they were exchanging. It, 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 it looked like they're about to French. They were like, they were like, when in Kalos. <laughs> I well, as that scene happened, I literally played it back and I went, uh, uh oh. Oh, uh, we gotta talk about. Oh, we gotta talk about the game. Oh, yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. Oh man, that's do. Yeah. Yeah, Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet, also known as my. No, I'm not saying it. Hot yeah. professors. No! Oh, yes! Here we hot go. Here we we've, go. Got, we've got some hot professors. We got the Giga Chad over there. We got the, uh, the Oga Boga. The Oga Boga Bill over there. With, with the amount of times Pokemon. With the amount of times Pokemon Bills. characters come in at. The amount of times the Pokemon Bills. characters. Oh, the Oga Duga Delf. Are you talking about the girl? Yeah, that's exactly what I mean. <laughs> yeah, Jeff, 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 you know, you know, you know straight well that that caveman woman, <laughs> they don't watch. Hey, I'm, and she's definitely not an actual caveman. Don't do that to me. She's 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 over here looking like uh, Captain Caveman, you know. Oh, Isaiah, <laughs> Isaiah, no, that, I, Isaiah, hey, that last retweet is actually funny Jeff, because I remember. Jeff, you're gonna hey, like, but the, hey, but the giga you're, you're gonna though. you're gonna catch like you're gonna catch like. Kodimax COVID over here. The, the Giga Chad, though. Isaiah, that last retweet of yours is actually kind of funny He's because, gonna sell you because NFTs. I really hear that all the time. He's not going to sell me NFTs. Uh, <laughs> who is going to sell you NFTs? The Giga Chad. The future. He's, the, the future. Uh, no, no. No, he only He only would sell me NFTs if he's voiced by Veronica Taylor. <laughs> it's not Veronica, it's Wait, no. <laughs> Did you just say Veronica? Veronica is actually How can you get cool. Sarah Nacho? Confused. Veronica's my actually team. cool. Don't don't see, insult her brain, like that. See, my brain already erases Sarah Nacho. Yep, 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 the smooth yep, are yep, yep, but they're giving the girl a pass. I yep, 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 no, I'm talking about everybody else. Like, he looks oh. like he's out there. Everyone, like, everyone, give the girl, give the girl a good plane. No, I mean she's still an Oonga Boonga cave woman. Jeff, you're just like fucking a crocodile at that point. <laughs> no, he, no. If 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 people are gonna say he sells NFTs, then she's an Oonga Boonga cave woman. Like, no, no, we don't. I got it. If he sells NFTs, then she's racist. They're deceiving. 
Are cavemen, are cavemen the ultimate racist? What did she mean? Yes. Be? I'd say so. That's why whenever Jeff sleeps with her, he has, he has to steal somebody. He has, he has to steal souls with a white man. Is that why? Oh. I, is that why I wake up sore? Oh. Oh. <laughs> this podcast is wild. Oh. <laughs> this episode is extreme. Honestly, yeah, Turo does. Like, Turo does kind of look like a crypto bro. I, yeah. <laughs> yeah. He is oh, not okay. a crypto bro. <laughs> wait, wait, the, um, wait, wait, wait. What's that wait. one girl's name? What's the rival's name? He looks like. He, I'm pretty Mola. sure this guy is the. Uh, he's like. He's the shithead who buys all the fucking RTX cards uh, that are. RTX. RTX. He, 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 bought all, he bought all the gamer cards. Nemona. Manola. Why can't the player character look like that? Yeah, I agree. I agree. That's an actual Pokemon protagonist right there. The thing the player character doesn't look like that because people are acting really weird about. Yeah, the only reason I why I know her name is just she a minor. Look. They look so stupid and terrible. I'm not, I'm not so glad they do, otherwise people will be sexualizing the fuck out of them. But they're Pokemon fans. They do that with every character. Not I have not not the Protags. They don't do it with only humans either. They haven't done it with the Protags for obvious I mean I haven't even seen Banner of the Protags in general. Exactly. The only ones I've seen, like, where people sexualize it is the black and white next XY one. But that's because people are really smooth brain about the French. The French? The French? Yeah, and the, and the crackers. The French. Oh. And then we got... Speaking of French, um, and nothing about the French, it's about the olives. French vanilla reminds me of ice cream, and it makes me think, Ryan, uh, listen, you may think it would be easy to, like, wait a minute for your ice cream, but, like, you don't know what it's like to have a freezer that is too good at its job, and you have to wait, like, wait too long. (laughs) Oh, 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 that's... (laughs) I mean, just... Just wait. <laughs> so I don't... Just, yeah, you know, just wait, sure, Ryan. Why would I wait? I have I have stuff to do. Pokemon oh, in this game are looking small as hell. I do really like the scaling for the game. Yeah, you yeah. do. One of my favorite things. Oh uh, yeah, favorite. but when I hear, oh yeah, Jeff, I never heard who you were choosing for your starter. Oh, you already know I'm flirty, and I have to go with the Fui like Coco. Yeah. Uh, yeah. He's going after the he's go, he's going after the woman who smells like a crocodile. Yeah. Of course, he's picking the crocodile. No. Is anyone choosing the stupid water duck? I don't. If you're I choosing, so far, the, I don't care. Hey, hey, I don't know about You never know; I, it could change depending on the evolution. That's usually how it goes. Nah, or like or we could ju- or we could just constantly press B. Or actually, hopefully this hopefully this game has the option to like just press a button to evolve the Pokemon. So like, you mean like don't have to take, keep to pressing a button to cancel legends. this. You need to have everything from Legends. I like I like all three of the first forms. Yeah, I, like they're all, I like they're all pretty them. mid. <laughs> I, I like I like them, especially the cab, but like. I don't know. I'm I'm still not convinced about this game yet. Uh, I I don't know how to. F- mm. I Indigo's don't know. just like Indigo's like. Why do I need to play this game when I could just go on Showdown and make my team of six? It just feels like this game came out of left field. I guess. I think yeah. That's. I'm not This yet. game. This game isn't Gen Nine. It's Gen Eight. What? Eight point five. Eight point five. My main my main concern is how they're gonna handle the because I remember when they were hyping up the online for Sword what? and Shield, they tried to get the online. Oh, oh, yeah, man. they were hyping it up so much for Sword and Shield where basically to not have a presence outside raids. And I know they're doing they... the same thing here, but it's like what's gonna be the point if we're all gonna be in separate areas? Like I'm gonna, gonna be, be doing that damn Ryan's gonna be catching Pokemon half across the league. 
Jeff's gonna like, be like some, some girl in a bikini, and then Star's just gonna be doing online battles. Like, like is it gonna be a thing? Where I'm, gonna be, a I'm gonna be battle? stuck in whatever Pokemon Ami replacement they'll have. Is it what just happened? gonna be like if me and Isaiah are like near a double battle, we'll both enter the double battle? If there's like multiple wild Pokemon, we'll all four of us, and it's like, how's that gonna work? And then there's the waiting, yeah, battle. they need to be more clear with that. Let's so have to wait and see because either. Either it's gonna be really annoying and then we're not gonna use it, or it's gonna be like really laggy and the, the Wi Fi will keep cutting out because I just like, hope what? it isn't like the wild area where I just like connect with people from Japan and Mexico and I can't connect with you guys. I'm like, what the hell? It's only it only happens like, randomly. Like, oh, this, the this, stupid codes. I mean, it could it's only like, be like um, it's only like up to four people at least, so it's like you don't think you can do random. Can, can it? Can it just be? Use my friend code, not friend please, code. Please, please, I'd rather have friend code. That would, be way, playing... that would be way better. Because yeah. playing Sword and Shield with, like, the wild area with your friends is like trying to play Breath of the Wild on a toaster. It just doesn't <laughs> work. It, you just see all these random people walk by, and then you talk with them, and they're like, I felt these cans of beans in the ground, and I'm like, okay. It's just like, what the heck are you talking about, bean for brains? Hello? I still remember from Sword and Shield where, um... They showed four people going up to that's, the brain That's like, not. Well, that's not what it is. I know. That's false advertisement. It gets me mad. Uh, if it's like, we, if it's, if it's like that again, that's gonna be. Uh. I don't. The thing that makes me mad is I. I feel like I just got Groundhog Day. Like, I. I woke up to the first trailer the same way I did for Gen Eight and Nine, and then this trailer came out, and I'm like, I just feel like I time moved. But it's I kind of have that similar experience. I can understand that because, like, just like I just woke up in a bit. Early... For me, I think the Gen Eight reveal was a little. How do I put this? Oh, it was definitely know. a little more active for various reasons. Oh, it definitely was, especially that second trailer. That second trailer was hype. Yeah. I don't care how much I'm being on show. That second trailer is hype. I, I know I what the problem is. With this yeah, but then everything what? went downhill like a week later. <laughs> it literally was a week later. That's the sad thing. <laughs> literally just a week. When we went back and watched that Sword and Shield trailer, I'm like, why does this game look good? And then it went to, into the wild area. I'm like, oh, it looks bad. And then I look at this game, and I'm like, oh, the entire overworld looks like the wild area. No wonder it looks like shit. <laughs> I don't oh, like <laughs> That's, okay. <laughs> That's gonna be funny when it comes because Alex is gonna be that big and rash, but this looks like the best thing ever. This looks like fucking shit. <laughs> I love this game. This game's fucking horrible. I'm so excited. Somebody kill me now. He says it's horrible and then he proceeds to play it way more than me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that's my that's my that's ADHD how it goes. neurodivergency grabbing me by the throat, Ryan. <laughs> My AHD's like, I love Pokemon. And I'm like, I hate it. And it's like, you're going to play every second of it. I'm like, no. <laughs> and it's like, you will. Uh, but on the bright side, at least we got an Olive called Small Live. That makes... That's my, my least favorite more. one. That's my least favorite one reveal. It, it cured my depression. I'm Let happy now. That thing, yeah. I know that, that thing stinks. I know as soon as you put that thing in the Pokeball, your Pokeball starts stinking. Whoa. I'm not that thing. Smile Oh, small. I think we're talking about Swallow. No, Swallow. No, I'm talking about Swallow. You put that thing, it's gonna smell like rotten fruit as soon as you put it in the Pokemon. Yeah, What's got... oh, no. Is it a? Is that the grass type? Yeah. Lechonk, on the other hand. Lechonk is my boy. Oh, he's your buddy boy. Me and Lechonk are just gonna be twerking. Isaiah, get that image out of my mind. What the fuck is wrong with that? Yeah, LeChonk's oh. gonna be twerking. Like, hey! Um, all right, LeChonk, time for the LeTwerk. The LeTwerk! Oh, yeah, and he, I, people are like, he's gonna be fat. I'm like, first of all, rude. He's a pig. Don't use that word. Well, Second it's not fat. It's muscle. That, that, yeah. that is yeah. literally it, what it is. It's probably muscle. He's yeah. probably gonna be a normal fighting type. He's probably gonna be the better Emboar. Sorry, Prince. I'm really, I'm really wanting, I, I really want an Abor Pokemon. I really want a Abor Pokemon. This is gonna be so cool. He's or gonna grow better, tusks. The better Grumpig. 
Can it just be a better double? Like, I really they legit like is no correlation like, between the, the best moves. It, it, they really didn't. I want, I want this to just become the better double. The only Pokemon, actually, I don't know. I wasn't the big fan of the Pikachu this time already. The That's Pikachu. my least favorite. I think you're yeah, both fans. Actually, 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 I'll take the Olive over. Yeah. The Pikachu. I think you're both. I think you're both fucking clowns. Chris, just Chris, let me speak. Shut up. No. Anyways. Do you want me to disconnect you from the call, you little bitch? Anyways. <laughs> I was gonna say, if I saw that Pikachu clone in real life, I'd probably kick it into the sun. No cap. And that would kick you in the nuts. This is why I don't want to have. This is the exact reason I can't like any of the starters. I, I don't want to. I don't want it to become some stupid popularity thing. Oh, like that's pop, not like damn popularity. Movie. That thing just looks funny to me. I just want to. I just want to kick it like a happy sack. <laughs> like, <laughs> it's just gonna bounce it between my feet and then kick it into the goal. I'll use Pikachu. I'll use Minin. I'll use Togedemaru. I even use Patch of Reese's, okay. but. I think we're I I think we're both super to sell. Fresh wants to watch the That's it. I thought they kicked Chris out of the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> you can't do that, so that's gonna fail. Oh, oh it's gonna no. fail. Oh, that's it. I'm gonna start working on it. Cope. <laughs> Cope. Like oh yeah, got, um, but I like that we got a thing like Sword and Shield where like we'll see the starters have a little cutscene before you pick them. Stuff like that's always super cute. Also, the Pokemon cry sound like real animals. Like, the cat purred. I think the duck quacked. We heard, like, little crocodile noises. And then we heard, like, the pig, like, actually oink. Oink. <laughs> like, it literally, it went... Anyway, like, is that that a... laugh sounded like, like an that... oink almost, Jeff. Like, I think I think these cries are going to be a lot more... Like, it's his bad brother. I, think. I like that the fire on Fuikoko is, like... Like, um, what's it called? Stylized? Like, I don't know, it just looks cool. Yeah, it looks like a little aura. Also, he's definitely becoming a, some sort of volcano crocodile. The way it described, like, oh, it, it, when he gets excited, the fire will spew out. Like, he like always is going straight to Spain. It's like, that sounds like a volcano. <laughs> yeah, it is something we use, probably. Yeah. Isaiah. I feel like the middle stage of the duck is going to be terrible. What about the final one? I think all the stages for the duck, duck, duck will be duck trash. The duck looks like a colonizer. He's I'm call dead. <laughs> I'm dead. I mean, so does it. <laughs> like, dude, what the heck are you saying? Why are you in my street? You're... I'm like, dude, what is wrong with you? Calm down. I'm just bleeding. Then said Sockway Blur. Sockley Blur, you are, and I just mute him. Is it just, the, is what it is just the duck mean? from like? Is it the duck from Courage? <laughs> is it the duck from Courage? What does yeah. that even mean? Sockley, what is that? Mean? Sockway, There's a duck from Courage. I know for a fact that duck are originated. No, I'm saying, what does Sockley Blur even mean? Oh. Wait, what does what mean? You said Sockley Blur. Oh yeah, that's words. oh yeah, that's damn it in French. <laughs> Every French cartoon character and like children's They always like, say it, yeah. Even Dexter, that one weird episode. I don't know. And then there's and then and then there's the fucking motorcycles. That I like them more than Zashian and so Zoma cool. Zoma. <laughs> Same, they're my favorite legendaries in that good while. Yup. We like them they a lot. So more. Good. Oh my gosh. They look so cool. Which one do you like more, though? I think, uh, what's the names of mine? Coridon and Moridon? I think I like the past one more. Yep. Coridon is the past one. Yep, I yep. think I like Coridon yep. a little more. Because I know that uh, Mirai is the future one. Yep. Mirai yep. Connection. Hello? Who's that? <laughs> that? <laughs> Fuck okay, y'all. Well, How did y'all not get the reference? Y'all are stupid as hell. <laughs> no, we got it. It just made my ears start to bleed. I mean, my ears my ears start to bleed whenever I hear you talk on the call, so we're both I'm at least glad body. that I'm at least glad that Pokemon games are starting to have more version exclusives. If they're gonna keep doing two games, they yeah. might as well 
give a reason, like different characters, or like in Sword and Shield, it's like, oh, you battle B and Sword, and then Alistair and Shield. And here it's like, oh, if you pick the orange one, you get you get Captain Caveman. And if you pick purple, you get Crypto Guy. Do you think? Do you think we'll? Uh... So I'm a Crypto Guy. I don't know if if it's really if it's really past and future, we might get some type of Legends Arceus nod in this game. I hope, I hope, because that you're, game kind of came and went, man. You're apparently going to be able to transfer your some of your Arceus Pokemon, so uh, I, that makes oh, sense I, I, considering yeah. considering the what the game is. It's not. It's... I, I, it's just it's just going to piss me off. Still, they better have what? Oh, uh, every Pokemon. No, it's not. You Alex, should... it, they are not it, having that. Is not happening, Alex. It's already. I have that fact. Jeff, Jeff marrying a Jeff marrying a woman is more likely than. That's true. It's just, it's, no, it's just that it's like, it's, more likely it's than just that you did all the Pokemon from like Sword and Shield, and then it's like, wait, who, well, who dating a black man? I said like, that's like, like Frisk dating a black man is more likely than. No, 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 that is never happening. I'm sorry. Pokemon going. <laughs> <laughs> wow, well, we got that on recording. Oh my god, we got that recording. But I don't know. It's just I don't know. Pokemon just is being the worst. I do not yeah, like that thing. I am with Alan just in the fact, like, I do hate that I can't destroy my Pokemon. It's like, we're watching these trailers and going, oh, good, that T Toxapex is in it, great. And it's like, that's sad. I feel really sad. If Lycanroc is in the game, I'm going to break everybody's knees. <laughs> I'm gonna, I hope I'm it's gonna not be, in the uh, game now. I feel bad for all the Volbeats. That's, that's why you're ugly as hell. You're just salty. You just you're uglier. Up. Is let Mighty Anna be in the game this time? And then at this point, it's like I hope it, if, I like, hope Nico gets her wish. If a Pokemon like um Go Go isn't in this game, then it'll, it'll pretty much get go like another generation. And it's like, oh, wasn't in PDSP Legends, Sword and Shield, and now not Scarlet and Violet. And it's like that just sucks because that's like that's so many games that someone could be playing, and it, they don't even go back and update it, which pisses me off. And it's like. Uh, But I feel like we'll have a lot to talk about next week. I feel like we're gonna be getting a lot of posts. I'm ready to wait. I'm ready to wait two months for. I'm ready for. I'm ready to wait for two months so we get to see like the co hanger Pokemon. No, they literally confirmed by the leaker. We're gonna be seeing Pokemon news very soon. Man, I can't that's wait. I can't wait to good. see them. I can't wait to. I can't wait and to that's see. That's not a surprise Pokemon. because literally the trailer we got before E3, we got another trailer. So I'm not surprised. Yeah. For Sword and Shield. I think this one will be showing off, um, what's it called? The gimmick, if I had to guess. Oh, yeah, but once we name. wrap everything up, um, okay, do you guys name? think gyms are going to return in this generation? Yes. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. yeah. I don't think so. I don't but think. Was, wait, what was the question? They might. Do you think gyms are going to return in in the oh, yes. Yeah, I hope not. Yes, but maybe. maybe but, like, I don't want that to be like the driving story thing if they're going to include them. Have us do other shit. Gems? Oh, no. I think the oh, fact no, that they're gems. not in buildings really says a lot this time. I mean, I hope they don't, but... This could be, this could be something new. Just give us, you know, it's just... You know, trials or the, the trials for the past and future, maybe. Oh my gosh, let's go! The future is getting rid of gems. Let's go. Oh, maybe the past. Oh, hmm, interesting. The, what the future? They let you play the future. They're like, okay, you can have you can have innovation. Um, the past we had to play with H Elms. Like, oh, good luck with that. <laughs> Just a oh, man. It's like you have to oh, use right. no, this... <laughs> That implies we'll be dealing with like three different like, just world states, and I don't know if that's possible. <laughs> I feel like this might be the one game you might have to play both games to get the full story. Maybe. Oh, that'll piss me off. That'll piss me off. I was about to say, I know that's gonna piss off a lot of people though. <laughs> I mean, like, it's just like, I don't know. I'm Pokemon. Yeah. 
So, final thoughts. What do you guys think of... Uh, but now we're getting what we got for the trailer. Were you happy? Were you mixed? Were you disappointed? I'm happy. Uh, it they was showed it. enough. I mean, it's it's a lot, I'm but it was enough. Too. I, 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 to see it is it's a Pokemon I, game. I will say I was definitely happy about the designs I saw. Yeah, I'm excited to see what they have in store for us. Yep. I I'm curious about the gimmick. That's what I'm really curious about. I'm Does curious what? about I'm curious about all the fan art we're gonna be getting of the professors. Oh boy! Uh, a, oh, have you seen all the Giga Chad meme? I <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love how on every podcast or video they're like, like the professors are so hot, and everyone just like praises them as soon as they Man. come up and Ryan and Alex Me, like, just mm. insults it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like, you know, you know, Alex. There's a, uh, there's the Urshifu guy and girl, and uh, and it's like, Alex, look, there's the guy and girl professor, and I'm like, you know, the funny thing I'm, is, I'm not that you guys they only deal with the girl though i'm like you know i'm definitely i'm definitely biased because they both ain't doing it for me anyway. uh, i'm just hoping they give us a really good champion uh not a champion there's gonna be one <laughs> i'm just right for oh the i kind of hope i kind of hope the champion's a uh a woman yeah, it's been like a hot minute since. <laughs> I, know, yeah. I know why Jeff said it. I got you. Sounded so excited. You, Jeff, you're always like the most anti person ever. Yeah, I kind of hope uh, the professor oh. uh, is kind of like uh, a woman. Yeah, bro. Because the, the last one we got in the games was really mid. The anime and manga had to carry her. Can we please just the guess? professor definitely? The professor I mean, yeah, definitely every people. female champion except for Iris, who's been good in all videos. <laughs> you're right. Mm. I don't know, man. Pokemon just sucks. <laughs> 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 I mean, I mean, we're not gonna. Sit, I mean, we're not gonna sit there and pretend like Legends Arceus wasn't amazing, though. Oh yeah, yeah, it was. But then they took it away. <laughs> they they went. They went. Here's, here's your new. Here, here's your. Here's your. Here's your free. Uh, oh, I'll... here's your free cupcake, Alex. And I'm like, wow, this is amazing. And then they go, uh, here's. The Scarlet and Violet! I go, I don't want this. Nah, nah, I'll tell you what happened. I'll tell you, I'll tell you what happened. The Pokemon company looked at Legends Arceus and they're like, Okay, so when's that Hisuian Charizard coming out? The Hisuian what, sir? Charizard's not in the game. So anyway, Scarlet and Violet are coming out. <laughs> I, I mean, like, I, I just hear shit like, This game is gonna not be an evolution for Pokemon. It's gonna be a revolution. The renaissance just, just, of Pokemon. I'm like, I wonder, I, I, wonder I wonder who you're referring to. I don't know. Could I, be, I, I don't know. Probably totally I, not Mark. I, I possibly saw the video you got that line. Uh, it's totally not Mark. He's, he's yeah. definitely gonna come at me again. I bet. I love Mark. I love Mark. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's a reference. All right, and that's it. I'm to done. end all things, we just wanna I'm say... Done. Period. Respect black Pokemon characters, you racist crackheads. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yep.